What's up everyone? In this tutorial, we will be showing you how we made a giant in Unreal Engine. The technique we will be using is commonly known as inverse scaling. This method helps us maintain the correct proportions and perspective even when scaling our actors to gigantic sizes. Let's get started. Here in Unreal Sequencer, we have our pre-keyed footage and camera tracking data. Here we have a scene locator, scene camera actor, and an image plate. When we play our sequence, you can see that it's tracked. And when we look at the Cine Camera Transform setting, you can see the tracking data is coming in fine. These are the keyframes that control the movement and position of the camera. Our Cine Camera is attached to the Scene Locator Actor, meaning any scaling we do on the Scene Locator will also be applied to the Cine Camera. However, to keep the camera at the original size, we'll use the camera component in the Cine Camera Actor and apply inverse scaling. Click on the Scene Locator Actor. We want to scale it up until our talent looks like a giant. A scale of 35 looks about right for this effect. Go to the Cine Camera Actor and select the camera component. To get the correct scale for the camera component, we need to use inverse scaling. This means dividing 1 by the scale of the scene locator, which is 35. Let's use a calculator to divide 1 by 35, which gives us 0.0285714. Unreal will simplify it, but we will select all and paste this value into the camera component. As you can see, this has scaled the camera component by the inverse of the scene locator scale effectively bringing our Cine cameras back to its original size. Scrolling through the take, we see our camera position and tracking remain the same. We will rotate the scene locator so our talent is centered. And there you have it. That's how you create a giant in Unreal Engine using inverse scaling. We will now render out our image sequence. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.